as the Australian housing market continues to present challenges for many aspiring homeowners, rentvesting has emerged as a popular trend. Rentvesting involves renting a property to live in while simultaneously purchasing an investment property in a more affordable location to lease out. This strategy allows individuals to benefit from capital gains on their investment property while living in a location of their choice, with the goal of eventually upsizing to their dream home. However, there are risks associated with rent vesting that should be carefully considered. One key challenge is that not all properties appreciate at the same rate. Typically, the properties available to rent vesters are more affordable houses in regional areas or apartments in the city which tend to appreciate at a slower rate than inner-city houses. Additionally, out-of-town buyers may face challenges in monitoring their investments from a distance and may not achieve the desired property ladder or climb. Investing in property also comes with various costs that can impact overall returns. While borrowing to invest in property is often easier than borrowing to invest in stocks, property investors face additional costs such as capital gains tax higher interest rates on mortgages, insurance fees, property management costs, and maintenance expenses. Negative gearing, a tax strategy that allows investors to deduct losses on their property against other income, may not always provide significant benefits. The impact of rent vesting on housing affordability in Australia remains a topic of debate. Rent vesters who rent in crowded inner city areas while investing in regional properties could potentially worsen affordability in both markets. However, if rent vesters eventually move up the property ladder by selling in regional areas and purchasing in the city, this effect may be reversed. In conclusion, rent vesting is not a one size fits all solution to Australia's housing market challenges. Potential investors should carefully weigh the benefits and risks of property investment considering alternative options such as purchasing a home up front. Efforts to increase housing supply should also be prioritized to address broader affordability issues in the market. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe for more informative content on property investment strategies.